Well, the flights into Japan and, and Korea are still relatively new. Obviously, Korea has a very strong association with Abu Dhabi. The uh, nuclear program will be constructed by the Korean firms. So we expect that to be a very strong route as we move forward. In regard to Japan, obviously we fly into Narita and into Nagoya. Uh, we'll still be committed to those markets. Obviously we've seen a reduction in some traffic, especially the group traffic, but the Japanese are very resilient and we have no doubt that market will come back over time. Well, the uh, quarter one was already affected by what happened in North Africa, Cairo and the Gulf, and that impacted our C factor by a couple of percent, so we compensated by taking out more costs. What's been positive is that cargo is setting record numbers. So as we move into quarter two, the underlying trends are good. The home market in the United Arab Emirates will travel this year. It's going long haul, so we're bullish. But like in any business, it's quarter by quarter. Let's go through quarter two, and then we'll have a look at the quarter three and four. Well, we operate three class, two class, or one class aircraft. So we place the asset where it gets a better return. So on high density economy routes, we deploy the A320 in all economy configuration. It's working well for us, it's running at 90% seat factor and gives us huge flexibility. What it doesn't do is confuse the consumer by a range of brands. So it's Etihad economy, whether you're three class, two class, or one class. For us, it works well. Well, Bangkok feeds obviously out of Europe and we operate three times a day out of London, double daily out of Frankfurt and Paris and a range of other cities, Dublin, Brussels, Milan. And all those flights hub into Abu Dhabi down to meet our two Boeing 777s, which are two class configuration, down to Thailand. And they're running um, all year round, in fact, an 80% seat factor. We have a fantastic relationship with Bangkok Airways, which in fact stretches the network within Thailand domestically to all the key resorts, plus into Cambodia. So, you know, we're very bullish about the Thai market.